Welcome to Excellence in Excel and in this video you will learn how you can use the rows function. So the rows function in Excel is different compared to the row function. The row will pinpoint the first value and uh, what's the row, row number of that value that you selected but with rows it will start to count basically how many rows you selected. So let me show you exactly what I mean. So if you want to select these three rows here, should be three rows. So with our function rows, then you click here and you see here input an array, meaning a group of values. So let's click here to get the formula builder. And in here, I'll just close this. In here you can just select these. Let's say we select here four rows. Once we did that, you can see the result is four here. Let's confirm. There you are. There are four rows. If we change this to, for example, instead of four, only two rows, enter, you can see now there's only two. And that's really how it works. And that's the rows function. If you like tips and tricks, check out the link below. In there, I have a wonderful Excel course on Udemy where you get free access. And if you have any questions, just post them in the comment section.